Hi, I'm Ranger Sarah Willoughby, and welcome to another edition of Glacier Bay's Ranger Minutes. Most people experience this vast mountain and ocean wilderness by traveling on a cruise ship. Exploring mountain wildernesses like that of Glacier Bay in my past inspired me to become the National Park Ranger I am today. You too will have the opportunity to experience firsthand the vast wildness of a dynamically changing landscape with abundant wildlife, rugged mountain scenery, and the massive rivers of ice that journey from high mountains to the sea, the Tidewater Glaciers. In the next few minutes, I'm going to share some advice to help you get the most out of your Glacier Bay National Park experience. You'll be spending an entire day cruising through Glacier Bay National Park, and it begins at the entrance to the bay in the Satake de Narrows, an area frequented by humpback whales, stellar sea lions, and sea otters. As your cruise continues, you will travel up the west arm of Glacier Bay, entering glacier country, where you'll have the opportunities to view several tidewater glaciers, along with scanning the beaches for brown bears. At the head of the bay, 65 miles up this glacially car fjord, you will spend an hour at the Marjorie and Grand Pacific glaciers, where you can observe towering pieces of ice calving into the sea. Afterwards, your cruise will take you out of the west arm and back down the entrance to the bay. There are more opportunities to view marine mammals in the Satake de Narrows. When your ship enters Glacier Bay National Park, rangers like myself will climb a rope ladder from a small pilot boat. We will set up an information desk and bookstore in a public place, narrate the journey up bay via commentary from the ship's bridge, present a slide program in the main theater, and walk around on deck to assist you with viewing glaciers, wildlife, and other natural features in the park. Glacier Bay has much to see and experience. To get the most out of your day, I recommend following these suggestions to ensure that Glacier Bay becomes a highlight of your Alaska cruising experience. Be informed. A daily cruise schedule of events, along with a Glacier Bay National Park map, will be delivered to your stateroom. Here at Glacier Bay, we bring the visitor center to you. There is an information desk in a public area on board your ship. Stop by and meet the rangers and plan your day. Find out when the ranger programs are scheduled and where they will be. Also, find out what time of day your ship arrives at the glaciers and wildlife viewing areas. Learn more by exploring the hands-on exhibits and materials displayed at the desk and by attending a ranger program in the main theater. Gear up! You can experience all seasons in one day here at Glacier Bay. Always be prepared for glacier making weather. Southeast Alaska receives almost 80 inches of rain per year and the summer temperatures can range from 45 to 75 degrees Fahrenheit. Bring plenty of warm clothes to layer in as you will want to be as comfortable as possible throughout the day. Bring binoculars. Glacier Bay is a wildlife sanctuary and whether you are looking for brown bears on the shoreline or peering into the deep blue cracks of the Marjorie Glacier, binoculars bring you that much closer. Later in the day, you can also use them to spot sea otters and humpback whales when you join one of the park rangers for a marine mammal watching program. Know your ship. Soon after you board your cruise ship, find the good viewing location. Places that are quiet and have an unobstructed view so you can experience that awesome crashing ice. Many folks ask me if they should be on the port side or the starboard side of their ship to get the best scenery viewing. I always recommend to be on the outside. That is where the magic sights, sounds and experiences exist in Glacier Bay National Park. You may see bald eagles on icebergs. You may hear the white thunder of the Marjorie Glacier, or you may gaze upon the lofty summit of Mount Fairweather. Being prepared allows you the opportunity to experience these wild Alaska moments in this vast, untamed wilderness. 
I and my fellow National Park Rangers look forward to sharing a Glacier Bay cruise with you soon. Thanks for joining me for another edition of Glacier Bay's Ranger Minutes.